Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. This is Justin Lovely Tarot. So good to see you guys here today. Today's reading is going to be for my Capricorns. So if you guys resonate with the video, like, share, and subscribe. If you guys want a personal reading, hit me up at JocelynLovely84 at Gmail. Alright, we're starting off with the Black Moon Astrology Tarot cards today. Man, we're doing a lot of healing this week, man. Scorpio's reading was rough. Sagittarius reading was rough. Capricorn reading, yours is actually looking good this week after like a whole bunch of turmoil these last this last month i feel like this last month kicked your ass like it kicked your ass and you're trying to recover from that and the reason this last month kicked your ass like that is is to show you something very important and i don't think you understood what the lesson was you're you, you it's almost as if two big areas of your life got destroyed or like got um it's like you got surprises, unexpected occurrences happen, and it's almost as if like you're trying to recover or understand why it happened in the first place, but and it's like you're finally getting your answer. You're finally getting your answer this week, so everything's turning up. You're dealing with the consequences, you're dealing with the pain, you're dealing with, with, with what happened to you. All right, we're starting off with Black Moon Lilith. The deepest desires of yours, the deepest wants, the deepest needs of yours are being recognized. You got Grand Trine next with blessings, right? Blue cards, tranquility, speaking up about how you feel, what your needs are, what your wants are when it comes to your happiness. It's almost as if the reason you're discovering what what you need more than ever is is and what exactly is going to cause your happiness, it's because you're willing to heal. It's because you're taking the time to cry and heal and absorb this energy. So it's like now it's so apparent why um, blessings are coming in. Because it's like you, you understand what it's going to take for you to receive those type of blessings. And you're willing to, to try that. You're willing to face that. Okay, you have self-load next. Life debt. This is what I'm saying. Some of you guys were born with some life debts that you're like been trying to heal from you've been trying to repair this these life debts you've been trying to make amends uh living amends to yourself and to other but it's almost as if these life debts have way have have weight is way it's ran its course right because it looks to me like these life debts were so heavy i mean you're entwined with this debt these debts were so heavy you literally had to carry these on your back your whole life for decades it got to the point where like you weren't even, it's like you were just surviving. And now you're going from surviving, right? Surviving by any means necessary to thriving because you made repairs. You're making, you're healing from this. You're making amends for this, right? For some of you guys, that is the blessing, facing and healing that, that that life debt of yours that you've carried around your whole life. It's almost as if you're realizing that you don't want to carry this debt anymore and you want to let it go. And it's almost as if this last month, again, because of the delays and all the stuff that happened, all the unexpected occurrences needed to happen so that you can see that if you don't change, these things are going to keep happening. These towers are going to keep happening, right? You got Libra, I balance, 19 with 20, Scorpio, uh, transformation. Again, transforming, balancing the, the, the karmic scales, balancing life, um, uh, agreeing to live differently. It's going to make you happier. Some of you guys uh, went from really masculine energy, doing, 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 and surviving, to now enjoy masculine energy and receiving. This feminine is receiving this energy. You're sitting there and it's, some, it's like some of you guys needed to take a chill pill. You guys were doing too much. Going out there, trying to thrive, trying to live, trying to do, trying to secure everything, trying to control everything. It's gotten to the point where like it's, it's causing you, it's causing so much damage. And it's causing like rifts in your life. You're not happy. And you're tired of not being happy. So what are you going to do? You're going to start surrendering. This is how you transform, right? With Scorpio energy. You're surrendering this. You're surrendering. You're trying to do too much. And for what? Because you have to survive. That is an illusion in your head. And you're finally realizing this. That you've, you've taken too much control of your life to the point where it's like, damn, you're hurting yourself. There's a difference between like... You know, being cautious and living life and, and, and being responsible. And, and then there's you carrying a burden 
which is too much responsibility, too much control, too much uh, caution, too much fear. It's like it's it, it's riddled. It's it just riddled you and weighed you down for too long. You need to let it go. So here you are letting it go, understanding that you don't want to carry that weight anymore. You want to be a little more passive in your life. You need to be more passive. You need to. You need to let go and have trust that the divine's it, it, it's taking care of you. You got to stop doing so much though. You're doing too much. And here you are understanding that lesson. So you're making living amends by changing that surrendering that and here you are you have sun spirit with jupiter benefits but look at the moon and look at the sun another balanced balancing and this person's with another person here it's like you finally understand you don't want to keep going through this freaking circle again and again and again this fucking tie to the devil here this this fear here it's this devil that's carried on your it's literally on your back because you're too afraid to live life free you're too afraid of what the unknown is. You're too afraid to just let it, things be. You're too afraid. And this is why, this, this is what it's costing you, happiness. Jupiter is in, right? You were, you, maybe you might have been Saturn with the delays or Mercury retrogrades with the delays, but here's Jupiter. Benefits. What are the benefits by you surrendering? With the moon, with feminine energy, letting feminine energy just be around you. What are the benefits? You get to meet great people. You get to learn lessons. You get to be happy. But you need to let go of this need of control, of this need to be right, of this need of, 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 of responsibility that you have on your fucking shoulders, this burden that won't let you fucking live. You need to let go. If you don't, you're going to keep experiencing the same circle lessons over and over and over and over again, and you're just doing yourself harm. Have you learned your lesson yet is what the divine's asking you. Oh, that was confirmation. I just heard a lot of leaves outside. Have you learned a lesson? Are you going to stop trying to uh, chase or live out of fear and just learn to be more passive and relax and let the day be the day? You don't have to show up at 120. Just show up and everything will be done for you. This is the type of life you can live, a serene abundant beneficial fruitful happy life and you'd be surprised how much security will be in store for you if you just stop trying to seek it or force it upon yourself and others let it come to you let it come to you once you do you'd be surprised at how much happier you're gonna be so you, this is when the inner child thrives this is exactly where the inner child thrives let it live let it come out. Let it come out and take over. You, you've you lived too long in, in the burden or shadow of you have to be perfect. You have to be like this. It's, it, it's, it's done. That way of being is over. It's outdated beliefs that need to be diminished and crushed. And that's part of the South Node. This is a life debt that, that, that you, need to, you need to heal from immediately. It's time. It's time. What are you doing still carrying that with you? There's, there's no point. You're just burdening yourself even more and you deserve to be happy. Your inner child deserves to be happy and free even if that wasn't given to it. Your inner child didn't experience that when it was little. Well, guess what? You can experience it now while you still have time, okay? Time goes by so fast now. You see how fast time goes by. Enjoy it. And every area of your life, whether that's work, relationships, whatever, be free and be happy. All right, guys, that's all I have for you, my beautiful Capricorns. All right, take care. Bye.